Geology rocks! <laughs> Get it? Man, Jamie, I wish I knew what these rocks were. I know, it would make our lives so much easier. I mean, what is this one? And this one. I have no idea. This one feels fake. This one feels rough. There are three different types of rocks. Igneous, sedimentary, and metamorphic. Since before dinosaurs were roaming the earth, small pieces of our earth have been eroded, which means broken down and worn away by wind and water. They are washed away to the bottom of rivers, lakes, streams, oceans, and any other body of water. Each time more eroded earth hits the bottom of the water, they are all pressed together and slowly turn into rock. Since sedimentary rocks are composed of bits of earth, they are easy to tell from other types. They are most often multicolored and normally not smooth in texture. While looking at a sedimentary rock, one will be able to see all the different parts of earth that have come together to form the specific one. Igneous rocks are formed both under and above ground. When formed underground, they are formed by magma, which gets trapped in the earth's small pockets. When the magma cools, it forms an igneous rock. Cool, huh? When an igneous rock is formed above ground, it happens from erupting volcanoes' lava. When the lava cools, that forms an igneous rock. Doesn't that rock? Remember the granite countertop in your parents' kitchen? That was made out of igneous rock. Igneous rocks range from dark to light in color and have many different textures. Metamorphic rocks get their name because they literally morph into another kind of rock. They were once igneous or sedimentary, but not anymore. The rocks undergo tons of pressure and temperature changes that cause them to alter their composition. When looking at a metamorphic rock, you can see that there are multiple minerals and crystals in the rocks, which sometimes leads to bonding, which is alternate stripes of light and dark minerals. It rarely has pores or openings, and sometimes has layers called foliation. Aren't you so glad we know all this stuff about rocks now? I think so mine glad. might be the sedimentary because it has so many different colors. Oh, well see, my favorite is the um, metamorphic because touch it. It's so smooth and soft, Ooh. like my countertop at home. It is. I love rocks. They're so cool. I love rocks. Geology rocks. Geology does rock. The end. The end. The end. Metamor- <laughs> It rarely has pores or openings and sometimes has layers called foliation. <laughs> foliation. Oh. Since before dinosaurs were roaming the earth, <gasps> oh, excuse me.